This is AP News Minute. The White House says North Korea's threats against South Korea will only add to Pyongyang's isolation. North Korea is threatening military action against the U.S. and South Korea. The threat comes days after the North conducted an underground nuclear test. President Barack Obama was in Las Vegas promoting the sunny side of electricity. He marked the first 100 days of his economic stimulus plan, saying renewable energy is economical, efficient, and a job creator. He claims the $787 billion stimulus package is paying dividends across the country. The FBI says there are inconsistencies in the story of a Philadelphia woman and her young daughter who were reportedly abducted Tuesday. Bonnie Sweeten told a 911 dispatcher she was locked in the trunk of their abductor's vehicle and implied her daughter was with her. But the nine-year-old girl isn't heard on the tapes. Demolition experts in the Florida Keys used explosives to sink a ship last used by the U.S. Air Force to track missiles and spacecraft. The General Hoyt S. Vandenberg sank in less than two minutes, creating a new artificial reef for sports divers and anglers. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press, with AP News Minute.